Once upon a time, in the heart of London, there stood a grand and imposing structure known as Buckingham Palace. It was not just a symbol of British monarchy, but a beacon of tradition and history. Guarding this iconic palace was an honor bestowed upon the finest soldiers of the United Kingdom, the Queen's Guard. Among the Queen's Guard, there was a young and dedicated soldier named James. He had always dreamed of serving his country and protecting the royal family. From a very early age, James had been fascinated by the idea of becoming a guard at Buckingham Palace, a position his father had once held with great pride. James's journey to becoming a guard was marked by unwavering determination and rigorous training. He spent years perfecting the art of standing motionless for hours on end, dressed in the iconic red uniform with a tall beer skin hat. His days were filled with marching drills, combat training, and learning the intricate protocols of palace duty. It was a life of discipline, precision, and sacrifice. One cold, misty morning, James received the call he had been waiting for. He was officially a part of the Queen's Guard. His heart swelled with pride as he donned the red tunic, tightened his polished brass belt, and carefully placed the beer skin hat atop his head. For the next several years, James stood like a statue outside Buckingham Palace, his eyes fixed on the imposing front gates. Tourists from around the world marveled at the stoic guards, who seemed impervious to distraction. Cameras clicked, children giggled, and tourists tried their best to make the guards flinch or smile. But James remained resolute, his face a mask of unwavering focus. As the seasons changed, James's dedication only deepened. He endured the scorching summer sun, the biting winds of autumn, and the frigid cold of winter, never once wavering in his duty. He took immense pride in protecting not just the palace, but the traditions and history it represented. One evening, as dusk settled over London, a group of tourists gathered to witness the famous changing of the guard ceremony. James, along with his fellow guards, meticulously executed the elaborate routine. The precision of their movements left the spectators in awe. Amidst the crowd, a young girl named Emily watched with fascination. She had always dreamed of visiting Buckingham Palace and seeing the Queen's guard up close. As the ceremony concluded, she approached James, who now stood at ease. Sir, may I take a picture with you? She asked, her eyes filled with admiration. James, who rarely spoke during his duty, nodded and allowed Emily to stand beside him. As the flash of her camera illuminated the evening, a tiny smile ticked at the corner of James's lips, almost imperceptible. Emily thanked him and walked away, her heart filled with excitement. That small smile, a rare and unexpected moment of warmth from a stoic guard, made her day unforgettable. Years passed, and James continued to stand guard at Buckingham Palace. He saw generations of tourists come and go, each with their own stories and dreams. But one thing remained constant his unwavering commitment to his duty and his deep rooted love for the palace and its history. And so, the young boy who had once dreamed of becoming a guard at Buckingham Palace became a symbol of the dedication and honor that these guards embodied. To this day, the Queen's Guard at Buckingham Palace stands tall, protecting not just a building but a legacy that stretches back through the annals of time. And among them, James, with his hidden smile, remains a testament to the enduring spirit of duty and tradition.